to techno and like dance music, all of that kind of, I guess, in a like in an electronic sense, started out in Chicago and Detroit. De um, wow. With Chicago creating house, they were communicating back and forth with um, New York uh, by way of various DJs starting at the warehouse, which is how house music supposedly got its start or got its name. They were playing disco, they were playing um, all these post-disco records like Zapp and Roger and then a lot of um, Donna Summer um, and eventually it got to that 4-4 kick that we all kind of know and the guys over in Detroit you know, um, the auto industry is on the decline. It's a site of urban decay. So the music that they're making is much more, um, is this this music in Detroit is made by cis heterosexual men, so it's a little more rigid. Mm -hmm. the, the the 808s, the 909s, the 303s, uh, drum machines that they're using, the synthesizers. And you're talking about the equipment used it's to kind of like make these program sounds, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Um, it's very straight ahead, it's becoming more rigid, and it's becoming this sound that is uh, the soundtrack to Urban Decay, so, which is why I talk about Detroit techno so heavily. It's very black, it's very rigid, but it's, it's, um, it's the music of the times that speak, I guess, pull from the, the past, but speak to the future and present all at the same time. And can you speak to like some of the sounds